Okay, it's so, time to introduce myself. My name is Crucius, or Cruz 6 for those having trouble pronouncing my name. This is my first attempt doing commentary, so I might sound nervous or just talking, just, uh, like sounds like I'm stuttering. So, just please bear with me. So, the gameplay I'm showing here is Halo Reach Arena gameplay. That's fairly recent, and I thought this might be a perfect video for me to talk about myself. In this game, I'm with a group of randoms, so I'm not with any party of friends. So here, I killed my own teammate with a rocket. Should just DMR'd. And I wish I could have shown my rating on this one because I did pretty good. But unfortunately, Peter doesn't show the rating; it only shows a thousand. So anyway, I'll be talking about myself, about my background in Halo, and how I got into competitive gaming, and my future goals of this channel. So my background in Halo pretty much was I was just late in the Halo 1 party and it was thanks to one of my best friends Brian that showed me the game at the time that I felt immersed into the game's story and I didn't own an Xbox and only owned the GameCube. So later on I bought my own Xbox and got my own copy of Halo 1 and the highest of beating it was on Heroic and later on Halo 2 when it came out and I just played the cap crap out of the campaign story being the highest I've gotten was just heroic also. I didn't get to be Halo 1 or 2 in Legendary because it was hard. Uh, so I didn't get into Halo 2 multiplayer because I didn't own Xbox Live. I couldn't buy it. So I didn't get into Halo multiplayer until I got my own Xbox 360 till the beginning of 2008 of January. And my friend hooked me up a copy of Halo 3, and I was hooked. I beat the Halo 3 campaign, I loved how it ended, and the highest of I beat it was on Legendary, solo, without much trouble. And then when Bungie announced uh, two more games, Halo 3 ODST and then Halo Reach. Halo 3 ODST, I love the side story, of including uh, the cast from Firefly, like Nathan Fillion. Uh, it was uh, it was uh, such a joy to see them in a <laughs> all in one video game. It was kind of funny. And then Halo, when Halo Reach came out, I love how they introduced more Spartans, and that uh, most of them are all Spartan threes and not Spartan twos. And then when there was, uh, there was also Halo Wars, which wasn't made by um, by Bungie. It was made by Assemble Studios. Because uh, at the time, Halo was supposed to be an RTS game and not first person shooter. So I like to see it, how Halo Wars went, but it could have been better. But hey, it's a Halo game. So after a couple months playing Halo 3, I got into competitive gaming and took part in the tournament I signed up for at ITT Tech and compete in Halo 3 knowing nothing. As a result, I won 4 trophies at that winning Team Slayer. VIP, Team Elimination, and Last Man Standing up out of the group of 30 people. I didn't have a team, but I was putting randoms with the people in there. A couple of months later, ITT Tech held another Halo 3 tournament and placed our first place team trophy in 2008, making a total of 5 that I won that year. I hadn't gotten into a Halo tournament since then until the recently I finished school. A few months ago, I went to a, a local Halo Reach free for all tournament and I was just practicing and I got some tips from T-Square from Straight Ribbon on Facebook who offered some tips on, or questions for the fans so I practiced in Rumble Pit for a month. At the time of the tournament, two MLG Pros, Prototype and Straight Stick from Fnatic Classic I faced against and it was only one game of Halo Reach out of eight people that registered. I placed fifth and it was quite the fun experience showing off some support for Halo. I started to show off some support for Halo since the um, the Halo community just by watching the live stream at the MLG Columbus 2012 and it was their last hurrah at the Pro Circuit and I didn't take part in any. I decided to just pretty much in the local tournament whenever I can get the chance to hear about it here in the Los Angeles area. So my goals for the channel is still providing multi-gaming with commentaries this time around 
gaming news, impressions, montage, maybe soon a, a goodbye tribute to Halo Reach before the release of Halo 4 coming out, another video towards Hit Call of Duty, uh, if you guys haven't yet checked out the live action of Halo 4 forward on to Dawn, I will link it to the description below, and also 343 released a new fight off of fitting multiplayer from Halo 4, and we'll link that below. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, please subscribe, like, comment, and feedback would be much appreciated to show some support. Thanks again, and I'll talk to you guys later.